When you think of the monster in the aerospace industry, what comes to your mind? Well, surely it's SpaceX's colossal Starship rocket. However, before Starship was born, the world only paid attention to one monster that shook the space industry nearly five years ago, SpaceX's Falcon Heavy. And in just a few days, we will witness another spectacular performance from it, marking the fifth and the final launch of 2023. But what's particularly noteworthy here is that this launch is the first time Falcon Heavy undertakes a crucial mission with the payload being the U.S. military's X-37B space plane carrying numerous classified experiments and other essential tests for NASA. To learn more about this, join us in today's episode of Alpha Tech. As Falcon 9 is approaching its 90th launch in the last month of the year, aiming to achieve the goal of 100 launches in 2023, its sibling, Falcon Heavy, is also gearing up to contribute with a launch scheduled for this week. The Falcon Heavy launch, sponsored by the Department of Defense and named USSF-52, is expected to take place on December 11, according to the latest announcement, after two scheduled delays initially planned for December 7, and then December 10. Shifting launch schedules and availability at Launch Complex 39A, LC-39A, were cited for the date change according to a Space Force statement. This has no impact on the mission's performance. The X-37B will be launched on a SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket from NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida with an unspecified launch window. However, these details will be announced as the launch date approaches. We partner closely with our launch service providers and the entire team is focused on executing a successful mission, said Brigadier General Kirsten Pazenigan, of Space Launch Delta 45 in a Space Systems Command email. This reflects the absolute trust of the U.S. military in entrusting the mission to SpaceX's Falcon Heavy. On the other hand, Dr. Walt Lauderdale, mission director and lead for Falcon Systems and Operations at SSC, expressed gratitude for cooperation with government agencies. We benefit greatly from our partnerships with other government agencies and from commercially derived developments. To be honest, this is not only an extremely important launch, but it also has great significance for Falcon Heavy. It marks the first time the Falcon Heavy rocket will carry out a mission for the U.S. military's classified X-37B spaceplane project. This will be the eighth Falcon Heavy launch to date and the seventh mission for the X-37B orbital test vehicle. Meanwhile, five of X-37B's six previous launches were carried out using ULA Atlas V rockets, the single remainder flew on a Falcon 9. If everything goes smoothly, Falcon Heavy might be enlisted for larger military missions in the coming year. We will see it appear regularly in the sky. To prepare for this important mission, a static fire test of Falcon Heavy's 27 Merlin engines took place last Sunday, a week before the scheduled launch of the National Security Mission planned for half a decade. During the riveting 12-second static fire on December 3rd, the Falcon Heavy, the pinnacle of commercial rocketry, roared to life, its first-stage Merlin 1D engines aflame, likely generating a colossal 2,350 pounds of thrust. With this fiery test, the fifth launch of Falcon Heavy in 2023 is imminent. However, there's much more to come before its grand departure. A return to the LC-39A aircraft hangar awaits, where the shield will be installed before another splendid comeback to the launch pad a truly impressive performance. Falcon Heavy, which combines three Falcon 9 boosters for the rocket's first stage, can carry heavier payloads into higher orbits than both Atlas V and Falcon 9, will possibly be launching X-37B farther into space than it has ever flown. While the spacecraft's operational capabilities remain cloaked in secrecy, the objectives for USS F-52 appear ambitious. The Space Force's release hinted at X-37B venturing into new orbital regimes. This is also good news for NASA because with the USS F-52 mission this time, one unclassified experiment flying is NASA's SEEDS-2, which will test the radiation effects of long-duration spaceflight on plant seeds. Although there have been crops grown on the International Space Station, these experiments are specifically looking to see the effects a variety of space radiation will have on seeds over an extended spaceflight. Dr. Yi Zhang, an advisor to the team of scientists who had studied the seeds upon their return to Earth, reminded them of the long-term goal of these experiments, stating, 
Remember, when we have a round trip to Mars, we'll be traveling for two, maybe three years, so we want to determine how long these seeds can be stored and still be viable. In addition, another notable feature that we can see is that this time X-37 also has the logo of the Space Force for the first time. This is an affirmation of the U.S. military for X-37, a brainchild created by NASA. The X-37 began development as a NASA program back in 1999. Boeing was contracted to build a vehicle to demonstrate new reusability technologies. The space shuttle would have deployed the space plane, which was made to fit in the cargo bay. The program was eventually transferred to DARPA, a total secrecy descended upon it. Two vehicles were built, and the first flight took place in 2010. So far, six flights have taken place. Its sixth flight, known as OTV-6, set a record of 908 days and 21 hours in space before returning to Earth on November 12, 2022. The X-37B, a compact powerhouse in space exploration, boasts a design that is a mere quarter of the size of the iconic space shuttle. Taking off vertically, hitching a ride on a rocket, this space plane is a marvel in launch engineering. Operating at altitudes ranging from 110 to 500 miles, the X-37B dances through the heavens with precision. It gracefully maneuvers in low Earth orbit, cruising at altitudes between 150 to 500 miles above our blue planet. Veiled in secrecy, the X-37B embarks on covert missions, and its purposes are not fully disclosed. A testament to technological prowess, this enigmatic spacecraft comes with a price tag of 192 million U.S. dollars a modest sum for the marvels it achieves in its four-year project span. Despite these impressive missions, the X-37 does not receive the same level of attention or coverage as other space events. The exact objectives of the X-37 missions remain classified, but there are speculations about its purpose. One of the more rumored tasks is the testing of various materials in outer space to develop more efficient spaceships in the future. The X-37B is also believed to be involved in testing next-generation propulsion methods, as demonstrated by the deployment of the Falcon Sat-8 satellite during its sixth flight. There have been speculations about the X-37 being used for spying purposes, particularly in China. However, these claims have been denied by official sources. The X-37's ability to avoid detection and change its orbit quickly has fueled these speculations. Additionally, there have been suggestions of top-secret unregistered satellites being deployed by the X-37, although these claims have also been denied. The X-37 offers a unique platform for conducting experiments and tests in space. With its unmanned nature, it allows for riskier experiments that may not be feasible with human presence on the ISS. While the exact methods and results of the experiments conducted on the X-37 remain classified, they provide the United States with valuable data and insights about the space environment. DARPA, the organization behind the X-37, is known for its secretive operations and development of game-changing technologies. It has a history of undisclosed projects, some of which have yielded significant results. While DARPA remains a covert arm of the U.S. government, other countries, including Russia, China, and the U.K., allegedly employ similar secretive organizations. The X-37B missions have largely gone unnoticed by the public, despite their potential significance. DARPA's ability to operate behind the scenes and gather valuable information is notable. While NASA and the Space Force often dominate headlines, DARPA plays a crucial role in providing data and supporting frontline space activities. The project continues to operate with a vague trajectory and distant goals that are known only to a select few. In general, the X-37 remains a highly secretive and innovative space plane operated by DARPA. Its missions remain classified, but it's almost certain the X-37 is involved in testing materials, propulsion methods, and potentially conducting surveillance. DARPA's covert operations and cutting-edge technologies make it a crucial player in the space industry as well as national security. Of course, that also depends on the means to support the mission of sending spacecraft into space, which are heavy rockets. Perhaps in 2024, 2025, 2026, and beyond, the U.S. military may continue to utilize Falcon 9 or Falcon Heavy. However, it won't be long before SpaceX introduces Starship into use, and it has the potential to surpass the capabilities of its predecessors. The future holds exciting possibilities of Starship, promising advancements beyond the current capabilities.
That's all for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. Please let us know what you think in the comments section below. Your feedback is very important to us and helps us make better videos for you. Thanks so much for watching and see you next time.